What's up everybody? Welcome back to the flyest, livest, dopest, hardest, realest YouTube channel on the planet. You watch Luciano TV. Make sure you stay true and hit the like button. And also, don't be a hater on your life. Subscribe, go ahead and click the little bell as well. That way you get notified every time we drop a new video. Man, I'm out here finna mail this merch to y'all. I smell this heart's chicken next door. I think it's calling my name. I might have to go eat. But hey, don't forget, the link is always in the description. We got hats. We got shirts, we got everything, man. Go to LuchaOnTV.com. What's up everybody? Today it is Wednesday I think. Yeah, it is Wednesday and it is hump day you guys. It is the middle of the week. Um, again, congratulations to all the kids that have been going back to school this week. I wish you the best of luck this year. Leggy's actually mailing all of y'all's merch right now and I'm in the car waiting. Houston is asleep in the back. You guys, the 90 day challenge continues. I'm not about to play with y'all. We are really gonna try and step up this uh, whole YouTube thing. I want to do exciting things, but as y'all know, we are trying to get back into the schedule of um, having the kids at school, you know, the times that they get back, which they all get back at different timings. Kingston's been getting back so late, you guys. Like, he gets home from school, like, almost at 5. So, um, yeah, by the time he gets home, he's hungry, he has to shower, and then they have to go to sleep. So, I don't know, I kind of miss them at times. We're trying to get back into the schedule of them being in school and now the school schedule is like so different back then he was in elementary with Gigi and leah and now he's in middle school and he gets home late so it's kind of like i don't know anyways um i don't know i think i'm kind of hungry i ate breakfast um whenever lucky gets back in the car we might go out to eat i don't know he came out here talking about he smelled that heart chicken and I am not doing heart chicken today, you guys. Welcome back to Luciano TV. I was going the wrong way. Baby say she needs a wax on her underarms and her mustache and her chin and her eyebrows. That is not what I need. What do you need? You guys, that was not what I needed. I need a wax in my underarms. I've been growing my armpit hairs for like a good two weeks. So they're they, like, they long, they long they looking like, them, they like. looking like little monsters under my armpits. It but like she can get braids. it's okay because they do not look that long. It's okay because we're about to go get them wax today and I'm also gonna get another wax. But right now I wanna go to Luby's. I ain't been to Luby's in forever. Did he I'm... just cut me off? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry. I just wanna go to Luby's. I'm hungry. Fun fact, my mom worked at Luby's for like 21 years. That's a long time, you guys, 21 years. So Luby's was like my second home because after school, there was days that I had to go after school to her job because we didn't have a babysitter or whatever. So I would stay there like from like four all the way to like 11 sometimes. So yeah, Luby's, shout out to Luby's. What's your favorite dish, the OG roast beef? Is it the OG roast beef? I like their um, fried fish. It's really good. But anyways, get that Luan platter. We'll, 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 <laughs> <laughs> Lucky Luan we'll platter. See, we'll see y'all when we get there. We have made it to movies. Yay! Round of applause. Say hi. Hey, Houston just woke up. We're gonna go eat. Yes, we can go eat. Y'all, Houston's getting so big. Thank you. Oh, you're smiling. 
know that that arrest. I haven't had Louis in forever. I'm about to see what they have. It's like a cafeteria, but it's so good. He had some already. Yep, give us some of this. So we're gonna get Houston some a fruit cup. Are you getting a salad? Yep. Yummy. So this is for Houston. Put it on the tray. So Lucky got a salad. Y'all. Oh shoot. What are you getting? Chicken. That tilapia looks so good. Oh my goodness. Y'all, do y'all see this? Those yams looking good. Yes, please. So I got fried fish with some rice. And that that's it for sides. Oh, I'll take some mashed potatoes. Yeah, please. So like I said, I got this fried fish with rice and mashed potatoes. That's lucky salad. And that's Houston's little fruit bowl. And I got jalapeno cornbread. What did you get? I got chicken fried chicken, mashed potatoes, cabbage, sweet potato, a roll, and a jalapeno pepper. Oh, yeah? Hey, Dada. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted to eat. Houston. Get it on. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> 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 Try this chicken fried chicken out. <laughs> oh, this nigga's a badass. <laughs> Ever since he got his fork, he's been shoving stuff down his mouth <laughs> without giving himself a break. <laughs> hey. Houston. You being such a good boy? Yeah. <laughs> Man, don't ever go to Luby's when you're hungry. Because you start just grabbing stuff. <laughs> And then you be sitting there trying to finish it all up and your stomach just feel like it's about to pop. Woo. We'll be back with y'all. That was good. Woo. I am stuffed, you guys. Loobies came through. So I think we're gonna head to go get my wax and then we have to go grocery shopping and run our daily errands that we just have to run. It is Wednesday once again. It's the middle. It's the middle of the week. <laughs> it is Wednesday once again. It is the middle of the week, you guys. Make sure you stay true to yourself. Make sure you stay motivated. Make sure make sure you stay positive. Make sure you stay motivated, and make sure that you are spreading love and positivity. I'm about to get my armpits waxed. I just pulled up. Hi. So, they actually don't know if they're allowed to um, have me record, I guess, my procedure. But look at this armpit, you guys. That's so embarrassing. But it's okay because we are about to wax all of my armpit hairs. And it's a lot better than um, shaving them. So, I'm excited because I've done this before. So, I'm not new to it.
All right, I made it out of there, you guys. My armpits are kind of like burning. I don't know if that's a good way to describe it. Waxing hurts, but beauty is pain. I'm sitting in the back with Houston because while I was in there, apparently he was screaming the whole entire time. Houston, what was your problem? What was your problem? Why are you screaming? Hi, you're saying hi? So we ended up coming home after my wax because Leggy like had to take a dump. But he just got out the shower and I think we're about to head to H-E-B. Type in the comments, let me know where you do your weekly grocery shopping. H-E-B needs to sponsor us because we just be at H-E-B like a lot, like 24 seven, you guys. That is our second home for y'all that are loyal watchers, viewers, or whatever, uh, loyal subscribers, loyal fans. What's up, man? We back at it again with another banger. <laughs> Y'all know that we be up in HEB all the time. Boys leaving bread on the table, I'ma go get every bite. Yeah, I got me a little paper, but I still ain't satisfied. Saw gap up in the game and fell in where I fit in. Stayed up on my job and now that daily mail we get in. <laughs> Ask yourself, you wanna be famous or rich? Some people popping on the ground, but really ain't got shit. I'd rather have a million dollars than have a million followers. B bought a foreign nanny just to pop my children's collars. Fendi and Burberry, I've been sipping on Don Perry. Then big racks, I get that, you sit back, you scary Watch me from the sideline, I'm falling out here living Five hundred dollar cologne on, I'm slittin' like Clive Christian Straighten up, you slippin', boy, go give it all you got I, I don't do nothing but count money, that's why my hands so soft I look better when I pay, so I'm staying papered up Me and money go together, player, we ain't breaking up I hope y'all having a good day out there, man. I just want to let everybody know to continue to do good things for people and don't expect nothing in return and things will come your way, man. When you put positive energy out there, positive things will come back. I just left H-E-B, spent like $200 at H-E-B and I was like, damn, man, I'm only spending this money. And on the way home, she was like, stop checking the mailbox, stop checking the mailbox. And it was a $1,200 check in there I was not even expecting, you know what I'm saying? That's why I be going to church on Sundays, giving back, you know what I'm saying? Doing these little giveaways as much as I can, trying to help people. And God blesses me in return. So what I'm saying is do right. Do right by people. Do right by the world. Do right by your world. Do right by your family. You know what I'm saying? Be loyal to your family, to your people. You know what I'm saying? And do just be a good person and good things will happen to you. But when you're out there running around doing fuck shit, trying to scam people, trying to get over on people, trying to make little wins for yourself, you always gonna hit a dead end, man. I have bumped my head on the wall so many times for so many years, trying to just get fast money and trying to get over on people, and you never win like that. The way to win is keep it real and just be a genuine good person. Nah, I'll let y'all go because I gotta run up in this bank. I love when Kelly does this refrigerator because she does it so neat. Everything's nice and neat in order. When I do it, I just throw everything in there. And she be having it all right. She got my fruit bowl over there. All right, man, I'm gonna get back with y'all. I gotta help my daughter with her elementary school project. They told her to bring five things to school that meant a lot to her. I told her to take her blog camera, tell them that That's she's a, a blogger. Her Sachi shades because. But then people are gonna think I'm bragging, Dad. So what? You ain't gotta say they're Sachi shades. Just say these are my glasses and they mean a lot to me. I like them. Her picture of her card because she likes to play this game. A yeah. pencil because she likes to draw. Does that represent me? And her family. That loteria? Yeah. And her family because <laughs> she likes her family. Because <laughs> she likes her family. Anyway, we'll be back with y'all. We're finna get down in the kitchen and whip up this arroz con pollo. So I'm about to make some arroz con pollo, you guys. Like, for real, the legit way. And I don't know, should I teach them? I think we vlogged enough today. Oh. Oh. Well, no, I'll make sure to give y'all a before and after. 
this. I was in my room and I just followed my nose to the kitchen because I smelled it. And I think it's, is it ready? Man, I wish I could smell this arroz con pollo. I love it. I can eat that every day. What? What you talking about, Houston? You want the can opener? Don't give him that. <laughs> Friday, we're doing a hundred dollar giveaway. Don't forget, we're in the middle of a 90 day vlog challenge. And every Friday, as long as we're doing this 90 day vlog challenge, we're gonna be giving away a hundred dollars every Friday. So type your name in the comments and we're gonna pick one lucky winner this Friday and next Friday and the Friday after that. Well, before we end this vlog, we wanna give a huge shout out to Victoria Medina. Thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure that you type in the comments, turn on your post notifications, subscribe and like this video if you want a shout out in our next video. Thanks for watching.